Okay, now see this? This is going to be an experience that you guys are most definitely going to enjoy. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to introduce you guys to Dragon Ball Super Mugen version number 4. This is supposed to be a Mugen game where it incorporates sprites, and I'm telling you all right now, you guys have not seen anything like this, so without wasting any more time, this is Dragon Ball Super vs. Dragon Ball Super Broly, which I don't know why it's labeled like that, but let's not waste any more time. 2v2 battles are about to begin, so if you guys want to download this for yourselves, you guys can find the download link located down in the description box below. So here we go. Now just to give you guys an example, I want to kick things off here with Cumber having to team up with Jiren to fight none other than Mastered Ultra Instinct Goku and Dragon Ball Super Broly. Just because I feel like this fight in and of itself is going to be chaotic. So I think I want to take this fight at the Tournament of Power, which again, I do encourage you guys, if of course you guys are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button guys, slap a big fat like down below if you guys want to see more of this. Look at this, Cumber and Jiren versus Broly and Goku. Guys, leave your thoughts in the comment section below as to who's going to win. Now, I want to see if I can do a best out of three, but oh my god, Goku coming in there with that clutch. Dude, look at Jiren fighting back. This is insane, and I do believe that this is two-player uh, cooperative as well, so if you want to play with a friend at home, you guys can do so. Jiren's at max power, Broly is just like, look at Broly just wrecking the entire field, Goku just coming in there clutch, just beating the crap out of Cumber and Jiren, but what I want to know in the comment section below are two things. Number one, would you guys like to see more of the Mugen content on this channel, because we haven't done Mugen in years, and I mean years, and I was one of the first channels to bring you guys Mugen once upon a time ago, so now that we're here, I was considering on doing more of this. Look at Jiren just blasted Broly, bro. Oh, bro oh, holy crap, is Broly down? Okay, wait, I for a second I thought Broly was defeated, but, and, and, and my second question is, between these two teams, who do you think would win? The team of MUI Goku and Broly or the team of Cumber and Jiren? That's insane! Yo, Cumber and Jiren literally turned it around. All right, so I'm going to give you guys little examples of how, how amazing this is. Oh my God. All right, so Broly coming in with that clutch, Jiren just one-shotted him, dude. This is scary. This is so scary. Considering the fact that Cumber hasn't even transformed yet, it's really, really impressive. So, by the way, also, huge shout-outs to the creator of this Mugen because he actually did version number four relatively right after he did version number three. So, he's adding in more characters. So, who do you guys want to see in these Mugen games? Do you guys want to see fan-made characters? Would you guys like to see, you know, specific Dragon Ball Heroes characters? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm not too sure about this right now because they need to beat Jiren. They need to beat Jiren first, and then they need to gang up on Cumber. Okay, so I think Jiren has been defeated by MUI Goku, and now it's down to Cumber versus Goku and Broly. I'm not too sure about this, to be honest. I I'm not too sure if Cumber can beat Broly, but then again, I mean, in actuality, I think he can. But in this specific fight, Broly is just, like, tanking him right now. And this dude hasn't even transformed either. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Should I revive everyone? Should I revive the other warriors? Let's find out. Oh, my God. Okay, Cumber has a lot of health. You know what? Everyone's back. Everyone's back. Goku coming in with that clutch, that Kamehameha. And you know what it is, too? I kind of want Broly and Goku to have, like, a victory here, so... That was going to be the last time I was going to reset, but uh, if you guys want to see more of this, what I do want to know is what kind of fights do you guys want to see. I really hope that the creator sees this and he incorporates Rykon because that would be so fun to see my own OC in here because they have Zykor, right? So why not? Okay, Broly and Goku win. That's crazy, dude. And again, we're going back to the routes of the channel, the original route of the channel, which was long ago we did Mugen games, we did all types of fan-made Dragon Ball stuff, which again, this is fan-made, so what's most interesting is, I think that this encompasses um, great fan-made concepts, just like fan mangas, right? A lot of people love fan mangas because they're different, so this is definitely different, I'm really enjoying this, so after this, I have a good idea for a fight. Damn, dude, these guys are leveling each other right now, and it looks like Cumber and Jiren are gonna win. 
Cumber and Jiren are just gonna smash their way through, dude. That is insane. All right, so Broly is down. MUI, I don't know. I think MUI Goku could potentially be able to hold his own. But then again, Cumber hasn't transformed. I, I don't, oh wow, wow. Jiren just defeated Goku, dude. All right, so uh, fair, fair game to our homies here. All right, so winner. All right, so we're gonna go on ahead and do another 2v2 showcase. This is gonna be interesting. So let's do Gogeta Blue, right? We're gonna do Gogeta Blue teaming with i would say beerus okay versus the team of super saiyan blue vegito and his partner which is going to be a little difficult to find someone that's relative but let's do oh my goodness we have so many characters here all right you know what let's do vegito super saiyan uh blue and i would say oh geez there's so many characters here you know what for this, let's go with, I'm assuming, I'm assuming this is Ultra Instinct Goku Black, right? So, let's go on ahead and let's fight at the Goku and Gohan stage. I don't think I've been here before, so I don't know what to expect. But can you imagine this? Gogeta and Beerus teaming up to fight against Vegito and, you know, his own partner. In this case, having to be Autonomous Ultra Instinct Black. Or, or, or just Goku Black 100 years from now. Whatever the case may be. Look how cool this is, dude. Oh, this is gonna be a slaughter. All right, so this is Goku Black a hundred years in the uh, in the future, or a thousand years in the future. Look at that beautiful final Kamehameha, dude. I, I I want you guys to let me know in the comments, right? So let's say if we had Gogeta Blue versus Vegito Blue, who wins between the two? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you guys do happen to download this game. Make sure you guys go out and give the creator a huge shout out because for him to create this, it's a pretty cool thing. By the way, guys, also join my Discord. My Discord link is going to be located down below. So hop on in and let's have some fun, guys. Dude, this is I'm waiting for Beerus to go all out because I know for version 3, he did he made it to where Beerus was just insanely strong. Vegito, Vegito got beat, but it looks like MUI Goku oh, he's oh it's done. Holy crap. Look at the size of that Kamehameha, dude! But then again, Ultra Instant Goku Black is holding his own, so fair play to him right now. But damn, okay, yeah, so Ultra Instant Goku Black is very strong. I didn't even know about that, to be honest. Because most of these characters are brand new. So for me, I really hope that they include, like, Golden Cooler, Super Saiyan 3 Full Powered Cumber, if they were to include Ultra Instant Vegeta, if they add in, for example, possibly Raikon, and other fan-made characters. That would be insane. But now it's down to Beerus versus uh, Master UI Black. Damn! Black coming in there with that clutch, dude. That was good. That was really good. Okay. Did not realize that Homeboy was that strong. Look at Beerus! Beerus is about to end it all. Guys, don't sleep on my man Beerus because a lot of people tend to overlook him just because, oh, he's fodder or, you know, Jiren and Broly and blah, blah, blah. Listen, until my man comes back in Super and, he's, and he displays more of his power, then people are gonna eat their words. But my god, we haven't done Mugen in so long. I know for a lot of my OG fans, you guys are probably so happy, but this game is free. This game is free, and uh, by the way, if you guys wanna be updated with whenever I post a brand new Mugen video, then I do encourage you guys to subscribe and check the community tab because I tend to post things on there that will keep you guys up to date with certain things. So I will keep you guys up to date if the artist or the creator uh, tends to update the models and, and give us a brand new game. Okay, so the game is tied right now. Here we go. The tiebreaker between Ultra Instinct Black and Vegito versus Beerus and Gogeta. Oh my god. Yo! For a second, for a split second, Black was not affected. That was crazy. And by the way, I know we're going to create lots of Vegito versus Gogeta debates in the comments, but if you guys want to see more of this, just please let me know. It's, it's always helpful that you guys let me know because... I'm trying to do different things for the channel, and this is definitely something I wanna I wanna introduce to you guys. This is nuts. This is this is crazy. I, I Vegito's gonna go down first. Vegito is gonna go down first, without a doubt, dude. This guy is gonna get wiped out, either by Gogeta or probably Gogeta. If not, then Beerus. But damn, look at Black. Black is holding his own. And this could definitely cause ep uh, ep epilepsy, because this is just like, it's flashing all over the place and stuff. It's, it's crazy. It's craziness. All right, so, yeah. Oh, my God. Damn, they they ganged up on Black. Okay. All right. 
fair, fair game to him. All right, so you know what? We're gonna jump in with another fight, possibly the last one. So, what I might end up doing is I'm going to do, let's do Hit and Golden Frieza, right? Hit and Golden Frieza versus, I would say, who do we have here? We have a bunch of characters, man. All right, so we Hit and Golden Frieza versus Super Saiyan God Vegeta and his partner having to be, let's go with, uh, you know what? Let's go with Kefla on this one, just for the lulls. All right, so I want to fight on the Glacial. So, so this is basically the, uh, the Broly setting here. So let's just see how this looks. It's probably gonna look good or bad. It really all depends, but let's just see how the models look and let's see how this goes. Oh my, okay. God Vegeta looks good. Frieza looks solid. Everyone looks good. Okay, Kefla's in position. This would be interesting, would it not? All right, so, oh, whoa, he's hit, about to use his time skip? Poor Vegeta. All right, so Frieza just transformed. Oh my goodness. If Kefla doesn't transform, they are screwed. Vegeta just blasting, just sending off key blasts from the distance. Frieza coming in, trying to smack Kefla around. Hit has his, like, a, a agenda on assassinating Vegeta. It's crazy. And, and listen, I do agree that Hit versus Vegeta should have happened. That should have been a fight that should have happened from the get-go, but look at this. If Vegeta transforms further, that would be crazy, but I want to see Kefla transform. I don't I don't know why she's uh, she's not transforming. That's kind of odd to me right now. But damn, Hit, guys, Hit is putting in that work on Vegeta. Poor God Vegeta. See, this is what should have happened during the Universe 6 versus Universe 7 battle, right? They should have had Vegeta gone God first and then fight in blue. I think that it only would have gauged a tad bit better in a way, you know? Damn. Yeah, Vegeta is screwed. Kefla, look at Vegeta, he's going max, he's going max power. He's just laying it onto these dudes right now. But, unless Kefla transforms, Vegeta's gonna go down, and Kefla doesn't have a chance. Oh, there she goes. Okay, she transformed, there she is. Oh man, did you see, did you see how quickly she came in there? Damn. She's going right after freaking hit. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, Vegeta beat hit. Oh, I know, I know everyone's happy just because God Vegeta just beat hit. And they knocked each other out too, by the way, which is pretty interesting. Here we go. Oh, damn. You see that? Yo, hit came in with that time skip, bro. Yo, hit just time skipped both of them. This Mugen game is so fun. That's why the Dragon Ball community, when it comes to fan concepts, a lot of them have such great ideas. Alright, let's see. I mean, my if, if Hit uses Time Skip again, which I don't know what the hell he's doing, if he uses Time Skip again, then it's possibly going to be over. Let's see. Oh, Vegeta stopped him. Vegeta stopped him. Alright, fair play. Kefla's about to transform. Okay, so essentially, everyone right now is at max power. So... Kefla's transformed, Vegeta's using his god abilities, Golden Freeze is there, and Hit is unrelenting when it comes to his attacks, so let's just see what's about to happen. If he uses Time Skip, I think, on Kefla, then Kefla has the greatest chance of going down first. But again, if you guys want to see other fights, if you guys want to see more fights like this, let me know in the comment section below, guys. Hashtag million, roll to one million, because we're, I mean, listen, we're creeping up on that number, man. We're creeping up on that number. We, we've already made it to 600,000. All we have to do now is, uh, oh my god, it's over. Oh, wow. Okay, so the fight is over. All right, you know what? We're going to do a quick little random battle. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to do Zamasu, and Zamasu's going to tag team with, who do we have here? You know what? Yeah. So, oh, you know, let's do, let's do Zamasu and Janemba. Zamasu and Janemba versus Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and his partner having to be none other than Android 17, right? I think that would be, that would be a good fight in my opinion. I don't think that that would be bad at all. The stage of universe survival, here we go. The stage is set, now let us begin. Oh man, look at this, I am divine holiness. Can you imagine a situation like this? My god! Gogeta and 17 versus Amasu and Janemba. Yo, come on guys. You can't sit there and tell me after looking at this that something like this wouldn't be dope. Look at Gogeta just leveling these dudes right now. Damn. GG for Janemba and Zamasu. 
17 coming in clutch. I mean, they're not even using Bell White. They finished them already. Holy crap. 17 and SS4 Gogeta, baby. These dudes are so... Oh, it's, it's over. Oh, it's it's done. There's no way. Zamasu just transformed, but that... Oh, that that's a game changer right there. Oh, I, I, I might as well just close things off right now, man. Damn. Either way, guys, I do want to say thank you all so much for watching. Thank you all so much for your time. If you guys enjoyed, as always, give this video a big fat like down below. Man, this is... Oh, look at 17, dude. I love it. Man, whoever made this, we need more characters. And we definitely need new maps, like like the purple stage and stuff like that. Like, that'd be dope. So, again, guys, you guys can find the link down below. Hit that subscribe button, guys, if you guys are new. Also, like I said before, give this video a big fat thumbs up. And more importantly, drop a comment letting me know if you guys want to see more of this or not. If you guys do want to see more, then simply let me know. If you guys don't, then it is what it is. Okay, so, fuse the monster. My god. These dudes have no chance. No chance at all. And it's over. My GG on that one, man. Thank you all so much for your time. Thank you all so much for watching. Tune back in for more. And I'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below. Take it easy, guys. Damn, that was good. That was really, really fun, guys. Peace. This is the Galactic Emperor of the Universe. And of course, I'm here to tell you to subscribe to Unrelent Gaming. Also, follow Unrelent Gaming on these social media platforms to stay connected at all times. And if you don't, then very soon you will all be dead. <laughs> oh, did someone say Unrelent Gaming? Oh my god. The fuck, Zabon? Put on some clothes! Well, why don't you put on any clothes? What? I don't need clothes! Jesus Christ, that's huge! <laughs> what, Broly? Freezer. Uh-oh. Prepare to die! <laughs> <laughs>